I suppose really what I most want to ask you is how you can possibly justify investigating anything so totally useless as string theory. Hi, Robert. Um, so you ask why, how can you justify studying anything as obviously useless as string theory? Well, that's a loaded question. Um, let's assume that string theory is on the right direction to understanding the fundamental laws of nature at this incredibly small scale where uh, quantum gravity becomes relevant and the forces of nature unify. Of what use could that possibly be? And I must admit, I can think of no use at all except to satisfy my, and I'm sure your curiosity, as to how the universe works, uh, what are the forces of nature, um, how are they unified, how does space-time behave at short distances, uh, how do black holes behave, and maybe even what happens at the cosmological Big Bang, the origin of the universe. Um, satisfying one's curiosity is a goal in of itself, and much of science is based on just trying to understand the answer to these wonderful questions that we have always asked and now ask with more precision. Is it of use? That's good enough for me. Um, but it might be even of you more use. Uh, why you ask this question of string theorists, I don't know. Uh, you might ask it of astronomers, of what use it is to look and to try to understand what the universe is made out of, how it's structured, and how it evolved, that uh, is of no use at all. Um, but, on the other hand, it is of great use in making us feel um, like the intelligent creatures we are uh, that would like to understand more and more about the world in which we live. And. As scientists, as physicists, we must always remember that uh, elements, research in physics, at the very fundamental level, uh, have often led in the past to actual technology, things which are directly of use to uh, human beings um, in ways that none of the uh, scientists at the time could have, could have imagined. This has been the case since electricity and magnetism were explored for reasons of curiosity and certainly was the, is the case with respect to the quantum world which was discovered uh, as a effort to understand the microscopic world without any idea of how those, I, those uh, theories and uh, would be um, applied to uh, all the devices of modern technology. I cannot imagine in the, my largest attempts of imagining uh, new technological developments that uh, the problems that string theory attempts to solve, uh, even that if we had a solution to those problems, it could lead to technological inventions, but who knows?